So guys, for the first step, you wanna head over to search and then type in system configuration. Click on it. Now once you're on this, we're gonna click on services and then you wanna tick hide all Microsoft services and then click on disable all and then click on okay. Now for the next step, you wanna head over to search and then type in registry editor. Click on it and then click on yes. Now once you're on this, you can follow everything I'll be doing up here. So first you wanna expand HK local machine. Then you want to expand software. Then you want to expand Microsoft. Then we're gonna scroll down and expand Windows NT. Here it is, you wanna expand Windows NT. Then you wanna expand current version. And then we're gonna scroll down and then click on Windows. Now once you're on this, you wanna click on load app in it. And then make sure that the value data has been set to zero and then click on okay. Now for the next step, you wanna head over to search and then type in CMD. Then you want to run it as administrator. And then click on yes. Now once you're on this, we're gonna type in prompt and click on enter. Now we're gonna type in SFC space forward slash scan file equals C colon backslash windows backslash system32 backslash IE frame dot DRL and click on enter. Now for the next command, you're gonna type in ASSOC, click on enter. And now we're gonna type in SFC space forward slash scan now and then click on enter. Now you wanna run this scan. Now once the scan has been completed, you want to restore your computer and then the problem should be fixed.